Guys, we're back today for another site visit and the brickwork is almost complete. So if you wanna join me and check out the brickwork on this site visit, don't go anywhere. All right, so I've climbed up on the uh, scaffold here. Now we're gonna, we'll take a bit of a walk down here and um, we'll have a bit of a look. So first things first here, we can um, actually see an expansion joint. You know, now these get um, marked on the plans where the expansion joints need to go. So these are to break up the long runs um, on brick lines. So as you can see here, this is quite a long run. So there'll be a couple of expansion joints down here um, and they might put them near windows or like that. So these actually get covered with silicon so you don't actually see this once it's all finished. So yeah, now we'll, um, here we just have the uh, recessed box for the hot water. So that's all gets bricked in. It's another thing you wanna check on your tenders guys if your hot water system is getting bricked in. I'm gonna head over here. I wanna show you guys a, a lintel. Let's see if we can actually get down here. So we've got a sliding door here and um, let's see if we can get underneath there and show you the brick lintel. So let me see. All right, there you go. So you can see underneath here is the brick lintel. Now this gets put over all the windows and all the doors to carry the brickwork above. As we keep moving down here, you can see we have another, uh, another expansion joint here. And like I was saying before, they've actually put it um, on a window or on a sliding door, um, you know, where you find most uh, your expansion joints. All right, just got a few bricks here. Give me a sec. All right, so as we move down towards the back of the house, you can see we started up there. Now we're over here where we have the lower roof. Look at that sun. Sun setting in the background, awesome. So we have the sun, uh, the sun, the sun. Not the sun, what am I trying to say? We have the lead. Here we have the lead, which actually gets bricked in. And later on when they finish the roof, I'll be able to show you um, how this actually works. All right, I'll see if I can jump up on the next level of the scaffold and um, we'll continue with the top level. All right, guys, I made it up to the top level of the scaffold. So first thing I wanna show you here is where the brickwork actually finishes. So what I'll do, hang on a minute, I'll come over, I'm gonna trip over the bricks, so you can see the top of the window here. And when people ask when they talk about the drop-off height, they're talking about the top of the window here in relation to the brick. Now you can see here later on the fascia and gutter will go on, so I'll come out for another site visit and show you guys that. The gutter will come on here and the eave will finish under there. Won't get into that too much now because when the fascia and gutter goes on, carpenters are here doing the eaves. I'll explain that a little bit more. Um, over here, you can see a little bit of uh, you know, non-face brickwork. This is going to be some rendered, some rendered section here as well too. Um, and you know what? Let's just get into these uh, window sills quickly. So you can see just here the window sills aren't done. So generally the brick layers will come down about two course, continue the rest of the bricks. Um, also too guys, from a couple of site visits ago where I talked about the windows and the window flashings, there'll be a link around here somewhere, head back and che check that one out. But this is what I was talking about here. Here's the window flashing and that gets bricked in down here. And they'll come in now and they'll do the window sills. So maybe when I come back and show you guys the eaves and the fascia and gutter, I can show you the finished window sills. All right guys, thanks for joining me on today's site visit. As someone drives past. If you know anyone who would be interested in knowing a little bit more about the brickwork, um, definitely tag them in the comments below. Um, if you are watching this on YouTube, I'd love for you to hit the subscribe button. And anything you want me to show you on a site visit, definitely let me know and I'll make sure I'll do my best to get it done. All right guys, thanks for joining me. Bye for now.